Mucuna prurians, Wikipedia article audio. Mucuna prurians is a tropical legume native to Africa and tropical Asia and widely naturalized and cultivated. Its English common names include velvet bean, Bengal velvet bean, Florida velvet bean, Mauritius velvet bean, Yokohama velvet bean, cowage, cowage, lacuna bean, and lion bean. The plant is notorious for the extreme itchiness it produces on contact, particularly with the young foliage and the seed pods. It has agricultural and horticultural value and is used in herbalism. Description Uses Traditional medicine Itch-inducing properties Pharmacology Nomenclature and taxonomy Common names Subspecies Varieties The plant is an annual climbing shrub with long vines that can reach over 15 meters in length. When the plant is young, it is almost completely covered with fuzzy hairs, but when older, it is almost completely free of hairs. The leaves are trypanate, ovate, reverse ovate, rhombus shaped or widely ovate. The sides of the leaves are often heavily grooved and the tips are pointy. In young M. prurians plants, both sides of the leaves have hairs. The stems of the leaflets are 2 to 3 mm long. Additional adjacent leaves are present and are about 5 mm long. The flower heads take the form of axially arrayed panicles. They are 15-32 cm long and have two or three, or many flowers. The accompanying leaves are about 12.5 mm long, the flower stand axes are from 2.55 mm. The bell is 7.59 mm long and silky. The sepals are longer or of the same length as the shuttles. The crown is purplish or white. The flag is 1.5 mm long. The wings are 2.53.8 cm long. In the fruit ripening stage, a 4.13 cm long, 1.2 cm wide, unwinged, leguminous fruit develops. There is a ridge along the length of the fruit. The husk is very hairy and carries up to seven seeds. The seeds are flattened uniform ellipsoids, 1 1.9 cm long, 0.81.3 cm wide, and 4 6.5 cm thick. The hilum, the base of the funiculus, is a surrounded by a significant arillus. M. prurians bears white, lavender, or purple flowers. Its seed pods are about 10 cm long and are covered in loose, orange hairs that cause a severe itch if they come in contact with skin. The itch is caused by a protein known as mucunon. The seeds are shiny black or brown drift seeds. The dry weight of the seeds is 5585 grams slash 100 seeds. In many parts of the world Mucuna prurians is used as an important forage, fallow and green manure crop. Since the plant is a legume, it fixes nitrogen and fertilizes soil. In Indonesia, particularly Java the beans are eaten and widely known as Benguk. The beans can also be fermented to form a food similar to tempeh and known as benguk tempeh or tempeh benguk. M. prurians is a widespread fodder plant in the tropics. To that end, the whole plant is fed to animals as silage, dried hay, or dried seeds. M. prurians silage contains 11-23% to crude protein, 35-40% to crude fiber, and the dried beans 20 to 35 percent crude protein. It also has use in the countries of Benin and Vietnam as a biological control for problematic Imperata cylindrica grass.
M. pruriens is said to not be invasive outside its cultivated area. However, the plant is invasive within conservation areas of South Florida, where it frequently invades disturbed land and rockland hammock edge habitats. M. pruriens is sometimes used as a coffee substitute. Cooked fresh shoots or beans can also be eaten. The plant contains relatively high levels of L-DOPA. Some people are sensitive to L-DOPA and may experience nausea, vomiting, cramping, arrhythmias, and hypotension. Up to 99% of the L-DOPA can be leached out of M. prurians by repeated soaking in boiling water and then cold water. Acidic water significantly increases the rate at which L-DOPA is leached out. Pre-boiling also contributes to better decomposition of anti-nutrients found in M. prurians through cooking. The seeds of Mucuna prurians have been used for treating many dysfunctions in Tibianani. It is also used in Ayurvedic medicine. The plant and its extracts have been long used in tribal communities as a toxin antagonist for various snake bites. It has been studied for its effects against bites by Naja species, Echis, Caloslasma, and Bangarus. It has long been used in traditional Ayurvedic Indian medicine in an attempt to treat diseases including Parkinson's disease. Dried leaves of M. prurians are sometimes smoked. The hairs lining the seed pods contain serotonin and the protein mucunon which cause severe itching when the pods are touched. The calyx below the flowers is also a source of itchy spicules and the stinging hairs on the outside of the seed pods are used in itching powder. Scratching the exposed area can spread the itching to other areas touched. Once this happens, the subject tends to scratch vigorously and uncontrollably and for this reason the local populace in northern Mozambique refer to the beans as mad beans. The seed pods are known as devil beans in Nigeria. The seeds of the plant contain about 3.16.1% L-DOPA, with trace amounts of serotonin, nicotine, and bufotenine. One study using 36 samples of seeds found no tryptamines present. JJ Herbals Mucuna prurians, www.hortpurdue.edu Crop Fact Sheets, Mucuna prurians, Mucuna prurians protects against snake bite venom, Mucuna prurians var. Utilis, chemicals in. Mucuna prurians DC, Lyceum, Mucuna prurians A comprehensive review, Mucuna prurians seed L-DOPA content on the basis of seed color, research paper showing quantitative phytochemical analysis, Caldecott, Todd. Ayurveda, The Divine Science of Life. Elsevier slash Mosby. ISBN 0-72343410-7 Contains a detailed monograph on Mucuna prurians as well as a discussion of health benefits and usage in clinical practice. Available online at http colon slash slash www.toddcaldicott.com slash index.php slash herb slash learning hyphen herb slash 349 hyphen copicachu semicolon mucuna prurians and West African plants a photo guide.